Hello, this is Stephanie, and you've made it to my channel, Saving with Stephanie J. We're going to try something new today, alrighty? I have got, this is the Con Air, and it's the, the spin brush. Yes, you hear that? I know. We're going to see if this little booger works. What you say? Okay, there are uh, three settings, off, low, and high. And you see that it's heating. But I've had it heating, so it's it's warm enough, and I've got it on high. And you can see that my hair is clean, free of tangles, or at least for the most part. Okay. I'm going to see if this little booger works. Okay. Tell you what, let's take a big blob of hair here. Like that. We'll start in the back. Give this a couple of twisty twisties. Do, do, do. Okay. Enough being silly. Right there is where my hair always gets tangled the most. The only thing that I have on my hair is a, um, you know, the stuff that you put on there, like a heat protectant. It's the only thing I've got on there. Now, I know that this side here and then you've got this side. This is the side that has to go to your head because of the way it winds. So if you do it that side, you gotta do it like that. And then if you do it this side, you kinda gotta flip it around, do it like that, okay? Moment of truth here. And you get about, hmm, about an inch worth of hair here. Very important for it not to have any tangles in it. I have found that out the hard way. And you kind of put it on the inside of the barrel, kind of like that. See? Now watch. Ah, that's what happens when it's not doing right. You just let it go. Okay? Now I got too big of a chunk there. Let's get a little bit of something smaller. It's really hard doing this on video. Kind of put it in there right like that. Put it about right there. Sucks it in. Hear the beep. Beep, beep. And you can decide, yay, how many beeps you want it to do, okay? Depending on, you know, how coarse your hair is, yada, yada, yada. So, so far, <laughs> sucks up like fat kid eating spaghetti. <laughs> okay. You know, I'm, I'm a couple of beeps kind of person. Look at that. Woohoo! Okay, let's keep on going here. And so this video won't be longer than the Dickens. I'll speed it up. I'm trying to hurry. Okay, keep on going. I'm kind of going fast, so the video. Because you don't want to sit and watch for 20 or 30 minutes for me to curl my hair. Whoop. And it beeps saying, ah, uh -uh, Stephanie. Okay, that little beep, the little, uh, oh, ooh, 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 ow, ow, ow. A little varmint was telling me that, that little funny noise was telling me it's, see how it's got in there? It sucks it in. And you can hear it continuously rolling. Until, you know, then. And see? Get pretty good curls. Alright. I'm not going to do... Ooh, that was bad sound. Okay. Now, I'm just going to show you really on the front mainly. Because for time's sake of the thing. And remember, if I go to this side, I have to go and flip it around a little bit. And I kind of give it like a little half a twist. I don't know if you're supposed to do that or not. Now, this is hard doing to the viewfinder. Sucks it in. Like I say, a fat kid eating spaghetti. I try to be a little bit more careful on the front because that is where you curl you do more, or at least I do, more damage to your hair. So I try to be as careful as I can on the front 
Um, because that's where you, you know, that's where you tease your hair more. That's where you do everything. Or at least for me. That was kind of a, okay, it was a little straggly piece. You see, I got a little red streaks put in my hair. Thank you, Sarah. She is always hooking me up. If y'all want to know whoever does my hair, hit me up. I will gladly put you in touch with her. She is here in the Chattanooga and North Georgia area. Love her. I've known her probably about eh, 10, 12, 13. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. Ow. Okay. We're good. We're good. Like I said, it's hard looking in this little viewfinder of, um, of your phone and of your camera. And see, you just keep on working it. And I know that I'm not doing it exactly correct by pinning back my hair and, and, and doing all that. But this is kind of for a time's sake kind of thing. Because you can get the general idea. And you see that I am not going all the way to the tip top of my scalp. I mean, I could. See, watch this. I had an incident one time that I went very, very close to my scalp, and it, oh, okay, that was different, and it really, it really ate my, a little bit of my scalp, <clears throat> but this is fairly easy if it messes up to get it out, of course, now this thing, now all of this, it's warm, but it's not one of those that you jerk your hand away from, it's, it's okay, you see? And let's do a few on this side, and so we can just you can just get a final what for. Now, ooh, see, I about made a mistake. The open, ho the whole end to the head. Whole end to the head. See, right like that. Sucks it in. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 It's kind of like somebody calling you, beep, 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 beep. Hello. Hope y'all are able to hear all the little beeps and clicks and whirs that this makes. So that, ooh, now that was a good one. <clears throat> I've always heard that the more healthy, now that beep was saying, Stephanie, quit. Oh, there we go. Scheme again. Evidently there was a tangle or something in it. There we go. Okay, now it's going. Okay. Oh, nope. Urgh. Oh, ow. Dead coming. This is how, and then when this happens, you shut it off like that so it doesn't keep heating, and then you start to pull. Okay, this is scary. Mm. And I put my hand here. Mm. Yeah, I hear you. Oh, warm it. Arr. Give me my hair. Give me my hair. <sighs> Lord have mercy. What I do for y'all. Ooh. Oh, my poor little hair. It's okay. Thank God I had the thermal heating thing on. Okay, it's okay. See, it's okay. It's okay. <sighs> that was scary. But when that happens, what you do is you turn it off. Just flick it off real quick, right like, you know, it was there. Just flick it off real quick. That turns off the heating so it doesn't continue to heat. <sighs> Mm. All right. Deep breath, Stephanie. Let, let, let's move on to a different piece of hair. That one's, that one's not a happy camper, I don't think. I don't know. Yeah, let's go on to a... Okay, I've turned it back on. <sighs> Say prayers. I've watched on videos on YouTube and some people doing this. It is a nightmare. And they really get it stuck. I don't know what you would do if you really got it stuck. That would be, okay, that was not something. Let's see. Let's just get a tea tiny piece, see if we're having. Okay, it kind of sucked up some other pieces. Did y'all see that? The way it kind of, okay. Whew, okay, now let's go for the fried hair here. And you can feel that it doesn't, it doesn't feel fried. So I'm. Relatively confident we're okay. But 
and I'm not gonna give it as many beeps since it's already been through the ringer. And so you can just, oh, if it says no, no. So you can hear it making noises sometimes, and as long as you hear it do it about the same thing, you know, you're, you're decently okay. It's just the funny noises you start thinking, oh my Jesus. Okay. Okay, you hear that beep is like, no, no. There. It says no. Doggone it, give me my hair. See, really, when it beeps like that, you should really take it out. Yeah. But again, I try not to do it for too long. Um, I do have longer hair, and I don't, because my hair is about that long. And uh, I just don't want to fry the ends of my hair too bad. Now, see, I got a little bit of a tangle here. Probably that earlier conglomeration and combination of, see, I've got the black end to my head. See, you just keep working it. Now, when I get done with it, normally I would give it a, a, a hairspray. Just kind of look at it and see, you know, is, is that okay? Is that kind of what I want? Do I just want a few curls around my face? Yes, no, maybe. Just enough to give it a little something, something instead of just, you know, flat ironed. Okay, let's, let's, let's do a little bit here. I, I, I feel the need for more curl about right here. Let's give it one more. Now, you can buy, remember, flip it around, black to your head. Whoop. You can get these on. You can get these at Walmart, Target. You can buy them off the Conair website, um, and they're about thirty, thirty-five dollars, something like that. I was happy enough to get one off. Um, I actually went to CVS, and I had a like a forty percent off one item coupon, and so I got mine for like fifteen dollars. So I was really happy to be able to try something new for, you know. Generally, not a lot of money. See, and it makes pretty curls. Little ringlet curls. Now, my hair is the kind of hair that just does not hold curl. Mm -mm. You can almost hear my hair scream as you try to curl it. It's just not. And see, what I sometimes will do is I'll re-pick up, like right here at the very top front. Now, I'm going to put this really close so you can really see. And I will take this. Ooh, that's not good. Hang on and do one like fairly close to my head. And that helps give me a little lift right here. I don't mind teasing my hair, but um, sometimes I, I'd rather not. And so I'll just kind of give it a little, you hear all my clocks going off. You can tell I'm an old person with all my clocks. Okay. Like I say, I just done some of it, just enough to, ooh, law. Just enough to kind of give you an idea what it was like to see if you had seen this, flip it around, if you had seen this on TV, and you thought, should I order it? Should I not? What will it do? Um, do your research. Um, it depends on your hair. Um, just be careful when you start it out. Um, and like I say, see, I'm taking a little tiny piece and you see me kind of give it a little bit of a twist. I'm not talking twisting it like that. No, no, no. Just a little bit of a twist. And that way it's smoother when it goes in. And you're less likely, in my opinion, to get um, stuck. Because it puts it more into that little hole that, you know, you could see. And see, so you can just keep on, you know, playing with it. And you can curl your whole head. Um... And really, not a lot of time. Okay, and I will give. No, that was a part that we had the issue with. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna be too bad to that side. And like I say, you see me give it a little bit of a twist. Did you see that little blob of hair go through? Oh no, not again! Turn it off. Don't panic. Do some pulling. Dead gum it. Okay. Ugh. Okay, that is just traumatic. That is just traumatic to me. 
Okay, well, like I say, it's not bad. You know, it when you look at it, it's it's not fried, and you can feel that it's not fried, and it, you know, it feels okay, and you know, you keep touching your hair to make sure everything is just okay. You know, okay, it's it's not too bad, okay. But like I say, buyer beware. Um, it's something that you might or might not want to buy. You might go, uh-uh, Stephanie, you are crazy. It's just much easier to use a um, curling iron, um, hot rollers, blah, 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 you know, whatever. Um, see, when it makes that beep, it just, okay. Turn it off, don't panic. And just try to gently see how it's in. You just look at it. See, that's another reason I'm having a little bit of trouble is because I'm looking in the viewfinder of my thing. If I had a mirror, I could get it out quicker, better. So I know this makes it look even worse than it, what it really is. Okay? <sighs> All right. I have got to take a break. Now I'm sweating. That was traumatic. I like it okay. Mm. Does it help in a pinch? Sometimes. But I was your guinea pig. So, is it worth the 40 ish dollars? I don't know. You know, it depends on, um, I know somebody with, uh, ooh, there's a hair, ooh, dead hair, dead hair. I know that somebody that is more skilled at doing their hair and does it more often would be able to do a much better job than me. And so, you know, uh, so I'm not the best person to show you this, but, I'm not the worst. Does that make sense? I am your general consumer. So, just try not to freak out if it starts eating your hair. Ooh, that, that side does look a little frizzy, doesn't it? Run your fingers through it. It'll be okay. Here in North Georgia, we have had crazy weather. And again, it is uh, raining again today. But I think we're in the 40s or 50s, something like that. And so... Um, you know, I think it's supposed to turn colder again. So, you're going to have frizz. That's just one of those things. And see, that little lump, I was able to fix fairly quick. Okay, just kind of run, you know, do the old mom thing. Kind of kind of give it a little twisty with your fingers like that. And look, you're good. Okay? And it could be that maybe when I put that um, heat styling, maybe I put too much on. I don't know. I mean, the, there were instructions that come with it, but they did not tell you very much whatsoever. I mean, they didn't. See, now this is, would be the correct way. When it said beep, you should really stop. Give it a good brush. Make sure no tangles. If it's the black side of your head. See how much easier. So that's where I'm making some of my mistake. It's more user error than machine error. See? Okay, but if you're more skilled, better with something like this, I think it would be for you. Um, if you're not, mm, maybe, maybe not. I do not curl my hair like this every day. Y'all have seen me most of the time, I, I, I wear it straight, and most of the time I can just barely run a hot, um, uh, a flat iron through it, perfect, fine. And most of the time I don't even have to dry my hair, it'll just be fairly straight on its own. Like I say, it's, you can hear it scream um, when you wrap it around something to try to make it curl. It just does not want to. Alrighty. Hope this helped. And again, this is the Con Air Curl. Con Air Curl. Con Air Curl. Sucky thing. I don't exactly remember. It just says Con Air. See on the side? Just Con Air. Watch this. Turning it off. Safety first. Alrighty. If you enjoyed this and you like me doing little quick reviews, um, please hit the like button. Tell me what you think about it below. Give me a comment. Let me know. Subscribe. Hit the notifications. That way you see what kind of crazy stuff I get into, like getting my hair stuck in a very hot thing. Ooh. But like I say, it doesn't feel, it doesn't feel like it's, 
you know, damaged. It, it just feels okay. And like I say, I might have went a little bit too ha heavy handed on doing, you know, the thermal silk, silk uh, you know, the, the heat protector. I don't know. Alrighty. Until next time. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.